God, it's too yellow. My arms, these are gonna fall off. With our Chinese wedding coming up, Mew and I made an appointment with the Chinese bridal boutique to try on some dresses in preparation for our Chinese wedding this summer. When you think of China and wedding dresses, perhaps you imagine the cheap fast fashion dresses sold for cheap on Wish or AliExpress. In reality, Chinese dresses are far more intricate than I could have imagined. Okay. I really like this one. But before we share with you the wedding traditions and which dresses we chose, we're going to answer some of your many questions about our international relationship. So I have Mew with me today. Um, Mew doesn't really like being in the videos, but this is a special video because today we're going to talk about our Chinese wedding mm -hmm. and answer some of your questions about our relationship. And for today's video, we are going to use the Time Kettle Translator. This video is very kindly sponsored by Time Kettle. However, we have used these multiple times. Yeah. Um, Earlier today, we had a conversation, well, I had a conversation with Mew's mum, me only using English and she was only using Chinese. And that's the first time in six years that we've had an actual face-to-face -face conversation without translating on our phones. So it's just um, some headphone devices. New one. I'm going to take one. Okay, we are going to start with the simul mode. So this one, we each wear an earbud and we don't need the phone. We can just talk and it will translate in real time. Um, and we can both talk on top of each other naturally. Yeah. Okay, so let's give it a go. Uh,今天我们来到扬州,因为有一家婚礼,我们已经订了一个婚礼的店,然后邀请我们去进行时装,以及是一下就是婚礼所要用到的一些服饰啊等等之类的东西。所以我们才驱车三四个小时到了扬州 uh, Yeah, so we tried on the wedding dresses today By we, I mean I Did you try on any wedding dresses? 我没有我只是在旁边观看帮忙翻译等了很长时间 <笑> How long did you have to sit and watch? 四点五个小时 <laughs> yes, and I loved every second of it. Next, we are going to try the listen mode. Okay, so for the listen mode, this one, only one person needs to wear it. So you can give me the earbud, please. Thank you. Um, and it's mostly just for listening. So good if you want to watch TV or something like that and you want to understand. You can recognize different sounds and translates it real time into your earbuds. Tell me what you thought of me when we first met. So how did we meet? Was it love at first sight? This should have happened in six years ago. Uh, six years ago. That was in 2018. I 啊在那时候的话其实我们是同学啊第一眼看到他的时候就觉得啊这个姑娘长得真是非常好看但是当时有很多的啊很多的 一眼就喜欢上了,对吧?然后的话才接着慢慢的去接近他,当成了朋友,然后再一步步的往下去发展这样子 uh, Ah, uh, that's really nice to hear your side of the story Yeah, so it's, it's really easy to listen, it's pretty quick um, When you pause, then I can hear it So we're going to try now the third um, different mode on the WT2 Edge from Time Kettle. This one is best for if you are eating in a restaurant or want to order something. So one person can wear the earbuds and one person can use the phone. So you can read the phone or you can use the earbuds to hear 
When you use the earbuds, you can either tap the phone, the microphone button on the phone, or you can tap the side of your earbud. This is what we prefer to do is to tap it. I feel like it's easier and then we're not using our phone. So you may notice Mew touching his ear. This is to activate the microphone for him to start speaking. Okay. Uh, okay. My mother asked me today, when are you going to have a baby? So I put the question to him, to Natalie. When are you going to have a baby? <laughs> okay, so Mute said that today his mum asked him if we are going to have children. I think we'll definitely, hopefully, have children in future. Um, I think we're still a little bit young right now. Um, yeah, maybe in four or five years we can think about starting a family together. But right now, I enjoy spending time with just you and I'm not ready for such a big commitment. However, I do work with babies every day and they are very cute. Okay, I will give Okay, so now you can tell your mum. <laughs> what was the language barrier like when we first met and how has that changed to now? It was quite awkward when we first met and like our first dates, I didn't really know what Mew was saying and you didn't understand what I was saying. Um, and there, there are more barriers than just the language, like so many cultural differences and things like that. But I mean, we've been together for six years now, so we know each other pretty well. And even if we didn't understand something that each other says, we can understand through context or through our actions and things like that. Well, <laughs> I'm hoping it has improved your English because if it's been six years of speaking English and it hasn't improved, then we've got a problem. <laughs> um, so on the phone, you can use the mode where only one person is reading or you can have it so that you have the phone opposite and you can each read the right way round instead of it being upside down, which I think is a pretty neat feature. What did your parents think about you first dating and then eventually marrying a foreigner? Like, uh, is it a problem? Are your parents traditional? Do they like me? Uh,没有问题，是我喜欢的类型。那么我去交往，以及我们最终有了结果，是他们希望所去看到的。但是在这个过程中呢，其实他们也会有一定的担心，因为他们的语言其实是不通的，就是我的父母在过往的时间里，其实都很
I wouldn't I wouldn't advertise something to you guys. I wouldn't share it with you if I didn't think it was useful or if I didn't think it would benefit you. Um, and as I said, we have used it. We have used it multiple times now um, and we'll continue to use it, um, especially probably leading up to the wedding. Um, today, I left it at home when we went for the wedding dress fitting um, and the makeup. And I really wish I had it. Um, Mew went to go park the car and I was sat without my little translator um, and it would have been really handy to have had the, the earbuds. Yeah. If you plan on travelling internationally or you have friends who speak a different language, I highly recommend the WT2 Edge device. This is a wearable translator and it offers a hand-free experience. There's no need to press any buttons or hold the device between you. You can talk face to face with eye contact like you normally would and forget that the device and the language differences are there. The WT2 Edge has a 95% accuracy in 40 languages and 93 accents. It can translate in the speed of 0.5 to 3 seconds, so it's pretty fast. And it has smart noise reduction and a 12 hour battery life, which is definitely needed. You can also have offline translation in eight languages and a group chat, which supports 40 people speaking 40 languages in the same chat remotely. So let's get back to wedding dress shopping. For Chinese weddings, the bride usually has around three to five dresses. A traditional one for the morning tea serving ceremony, one for lunch, one for receiving guests in the evening, a very intricate dress for the bride's entrance and a final, more comfortable dress in the evening for eating. For this reason, brides in China usually rent the dresses from a bridal boutique who will also do your hair and makeup for each of the dress changes and sort out bridesmaids dresses and makeups for those as well. The first thing we did was try on some traditional dresses for the tea serving ceremony. Although we won't be having this part of the wedding, I still wanted to try on the beautiful clothes and get my hair and makeup done. I'm sure I like it. I think it's too After choosing a dress, it was time to get my hair and makeup done. After trying the traditional dresses, it was time to try something white for receiving the guests and for walking along the platform. <laughs> Finally, we tried some more comfortable non-white dresses for eating in the evening. I'm not sure if I lose my colour, but I do. Hello. If you'd like to see more of our Chinese or English wedding preparations, please let us know in the comments, along with which dress was your favourite and any more questions you have about our relationship. Thank you for watching!